well, I want to fax Mars. And I'm pleased to announce that shortly, I really don't have a timetable on this, but I intent, my intention here is to reopen alien artifacts. As you can see, I already have the land. It's not ideal, but it'll work. The last time I did kind of a stodgy museum type deal, this time I'm doing, intend to do more of an open air type situation where the uh, visitor can actually walk through a Mars photo to an extent by creating the artifacts and then Set them out and try to make it look like it's on Mars, rather than have it all in a stodgy, dusty museum type setting. This is all tentative, by the way. My company has contract negotiations coming up, and I don't know how that's going to work, but. If they don't renew our contract, then there's definitely going to be some issues there. And of course, they're tight-lipped about this stuff right up until the end. This is the land that's in by Inspire. I had two pieces of land here, and then some realtor made... Uh, another piece of land that was the size of the two I already had available, and there it was right adjacent to those two. I just could not, I couldn't handle, I couldn't resist. So I bought it, joined the land up, and we have alien artifacts. I'm gonna try to get. Uh, a little more participation out of people. I'm going to try using the same resin uh, situation I had before. I use a, basically a resin. Like I said, it's up in the air right now, but I'm hopeful. I've already bought this land. It's named Alien Artifacts. And I'll be ready to roll. My hope is uh, perhaps sometime mid-late February, if all goes well. There isn't any promise here. I'm not promising that this will reopen. I do want to get back to the research if at all possible. So we're going to say that reopening of alien artifacts is tentative. But I do intend to chisel away at it with what little free time I have. I have a plan basically for uh, technical aspects I've been working on. The technical technical aspects aren't the hard part. The you know, hard part is not knowing whether you're going to have a job come March or not. That's the hard part for me. Anyway, that's, this is a new alien artifacts. I haven't done that much with it, as you can see. But we will get there. And that's what I'm hoping. Uh, I'd love to get uh, some of the curiosity photos going because those are in color and I can easily tell when there's vegetation in the photos, which there is often. Well, anyway, that's about it. Let's hope this uh, goes through. If I still have a job for March, the only artifacts will be reopened. I'll probably have it open before then. At that point, I'll make the announcement, Alien Artifacts is open and ready for business. 
Like I said, it's going to be this more of an outdoors type thing. Like you see here. And I want to get some participation from people. See if there are any builders. You know, who want to research an artifact and photos and put it up. Still has some technical aspects to work out, but nothing I can't handle. Alright, that's it for now. Wanted to share that, you know, this is my intention to reopen alien artifacts and get back to the research. And it's because no government has any right to sit there and hide this type of thing from people. As far as I'm concerned, they don't have the right. I believe that information belongs with the people, not with government. with the exception of necessary military secrets. This is why I applaud Eric Snowden because I think he's doing an essential thing opening up a government uh, a little more for inspection. The government spies on us everywhere we go with the NSA. So I, I applaud Eric Snowden. That's it. Hopefully we'll have this open uh, mid-February or something. As soon as I've heard about our contract, they renew it full speed ahead. And hope to see you then. This is Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.